Our next movie is quite simply a masterpiece. It's Spirited Away, the amazing new animated feature by Hayao Miyazaki of Japan, who is considered even by the Disney animators to be the master of animation. The movie tells the story of Chihiro, a girl of 10 who's on a trip with her parents when they take a detour in what her father thinks is a theme park. But Chihiro, separated from her parents, begins to see ghostly shapes. Her journey leads her to a mysterious bathhouse where in the boiler room she meets a unique and unforgettable many-legged man named Kamaji. He said she wants to work there, but I've got all the help I need. Would you take her to see you, Baba? She's a tough little girl. I think she can handle it. The bathhouse is ruled by a sorceress named Yubaba. Why in the world do you think I should give you a job? Spirited Away is filled with exciting images and colorful creatures so rich and inventive that although children will love it, adults may love it more. It won the Japanese Oscar as Best Film. It won the Berlin Film Festival. It outgrows Titanic to become the most popular film in Japanese history. The soundtrack for the American version has been supervised by John Lasseter, director of the Toy Story movies, and this is one of the year's best films. It's an amazing piece of work, and you know, it's as if every child in Japan did a drawing and they put all these yeah, characters uh -huh. into a movie. The giant baby, and there's people with six arms, and spirits, and creatures coming out of other creatures. You couldn't do this movie if it wasn't animated. No. You have to have a, a budget of a billion dollars, and it's, it's, it's beautiful to look at, and it's scary, and it's weird, but it's sweet. It's just a, it's a wonderful, astonishing piece of work. It you really know, is. I met Miyazaki at the Toronto Film Festival when he had Princess Mononoke up there, and he mm -hmm. said that would be his last film, because he does a lot of the animation himself. It's not right. all done on computers. Yeah. There's a lot of, uh, of drawing that goes into yeah. these movies. And then apparently he went back to Japan and he ran into the 10-year-old daughter of a friend and was interested in the fact that she seemed kind of indifferent to her parents, mm -hmm. kind of lived in a world of her own. And that gave him the idea for this movie where this girl drifts away from her parents yeah. and then has to find her way back again and question her own values. And Wonderful. it's just yeah. a visual feast. It's just one frame and scene exactly. and character yeah. and invention and an image after another. Well, it's the world's good fortune that he made this movie.